What's up everybody, Kevin from Stingray Biology here today. We had a little issue here at the shop today. If you guys remember when I was setting up these tanks, um, I got most of them up and running already and um, I still had a couple here that I didn't get going yet and I decided, you know, today of all days to get some of them going. So I wanted to fill these bottom ones here and get them running. And in anticipation that when these arapimas get larger also, I have more space to spread them out and possibly uh, also grow out some other fish. But let me show you what happened here. After I got everything all filled and running, uh, I moved uh, some biomedia over here to get the tank cycled. I noticed water all over the floor here. All right. I had to figure out where the leak was coming from. And of all places, if you guys remember, I had these tanks here that had like a million holes in them that I had to plug up with the bulkheads. Well, that bulkhead right there was leaking okay and now it's a nightmare for me because I can't get back there you know so this is kind of a design flaw on my part because I mean I just assume that you know I do everything well and I'm not gonna have any problems and I've never had a problem with a bulkhead leaking especially a brand new bulkhead and I tried to reach around from the back um, I went around from the side here to the back and get around the tank and tightened it up a little bit I was just barely able to reach right and as I tightened it it leaked even more so then it forced me to drain down this tank unfortunately I didn't fill all film all that because I didn't think it was gonna turn into a whole production but now it is and um, I drained it I was able to remove the bulkhead with always help but now my problem is I can't get the bulkhead back on. I can't squeeze in between there. I can't get around from the back. I'm just too fat. And the gap that I left here was like only that much. So there's no way I can even get my torso through there to reach over the back to get this bulkhead back on. And um, I'm trying to think and come up with a creative solution. And I think I have an idea. So let's go, why don't you guys come follow me and I'll show you what I have in mind in terms of how we're gonna get this job done. All right guys, so I'm gonna enter into the office here and I'm gonna see who's gonna help me. Hey guys, I need a volunteer. Who wants to help me? You? You gonna help save the day? All right, I think actually you will fit in there just right. I was actually thinking about Tiffany, but... She's too big and fat! She's too big and fat? Oh, okay. All right. So, I think what we're going to do here is we're going to recruit little Kim here to come save the day. Now, let's see if she can actually do it. Um, I'm going to have to teach her how to put on the bulkhead, get it through the hole, and thread the nut. Hopefully she can do it. And if she can then I can tighten it up from the back and problem is solved. So let's see what kind of mission or adventure or headache this is going to turn Tiffany. into. Huh? Tiffany. Tiffany? I don't know. She's Where's Tiffany? Well, you're going to have to take off your shoes. You're going to have to roll up your pants. Oh, leave it on for now. We're going to walk over to the back because the floor is dirty. You're going to get a little wet. Is that okay? You have to go inside the fish tank. There's water in there. Uh, it's fine. All right, so let's get going. All right, I'll meet you over there once you're ready. All right, guys, before we get into putting this bulkhead back onto the tank, I wanted to show you what the problem was and why it was leaking. Okay, now this is something that I normally catch, and maybe when I was setting up this system because there were so many bulkheads that I might have missed one. Um, okay, but look right here. You showing them? Can you see here? This line? Yeah. Okay. These things come off a mold. You see there's a line there and a line here. It's a two-part mold that comes together and they, they mold it, right? It's mold injected. But what happens is sometimes when they remove the mold, there, there's um, some plastic that sticks up like about this high, about an eighth of an inch, okay? And that's kind of like an imperfection in the mold because if you can imagine, when the mold, two sides of the mold come together, sometimes there's a little gap here. So when they're pouring the plastic in, the plastic might be seeping up. So when they take apart that mold, you're gonna have a little bit of extra 
plastic sticking up right there and I didn't catch it, okay? Now, what happens is with that sticking up and this seal goes down into the bulkhead, right? Can you imagine what's happening now? The plastic sticking up in between the seal and the bulkhead is now preventing it from compressing and giving you a watertight seal. So that's exactly what happened to me. So once I saw that, what I did was I just took a knife, I shaved that part off and made it nice and flat, and now I tested it and everything closes up nice and tight. Uh, unfortunately, you know, it was just, like I said, such a bad design on my part that I didn't anticipate I would have these kind of problems and now it's gonna be very difficult for me to get in here, but who do we have to save the day? Me. Kim, right? Kim, look at the camera. Kim is gonna save the day, right? You're gonna put this on for me, right? Okay, so I gotta teach you how to put this on. First is, you're gonna go inside the tank, okay? And inside the tank, there's gonna be a hole. Hey, are you paying attention? There's gonna be a hole in the tank, and you have to put this inside the hole, okay? And then I need you to reach over on the other side, okay? And then, you gotta turn this. You gotta turn this, you see? And you keep turning it, turning it until it's almost tight. Okay, once you got it almost tight, then Daddy will take the wrench and turn it really tight, all right? But before I send you in there, I need you to practice, okay? So can you practice? Yeah, you hold on to that. Go ahead, spin that one on for me. Can you do it? The other way, this way, okay? Spin, keep spinning. Perfect. All right, that's it. Oh, is it stuck? Keep turning, you gotta keep turning. Okay, it's tight, okay. Keep going. It gets easier, okay? All right, I think that's good. So, that was a good practice run. All right, good job, Kim. So, we're gonna get you inside the tank now. Okay, it's gonna be really tight in there. Hopefully you can do it. All right? All right, let's go. Fish with glasses. Huh? No, no fish. No, fish not gonna bite you. All right, come on, guys. I got the flashlight right here. All right, Kim, go ahead. Mommy's gonna help, or I'll help you then. Oh, you're gonna help her. All right, Kim, so you have to get in here, okay? So go ahead, take off the one slipper. Go ahead, take off one slipper. Go in, okay, bend forward, then bend this way. Okay, put your hand right here. Take off the other slipper. Nothing oh, to the... No, no, no. All right, go ahead, go. go. You know what, wrong, take this foot out. Take this foot out. This way? Yeah. Okay, you gotta stand on the slip. You gotta go this way. Get your head in first. Yes. Yeah, climb over. Now, ready? See? Okay? You're in? Go ahead, keep going. Can you go? Yeah. Nothing to be scared about. Come on. Yeah. Huh? We have to go inside. Come on, just put your feet down. Yes, go. Okay? Okay, very good. Now, just move it out of the way. Just wiggle your feet and move it out of the way. Yes, uh huh. Good job, good job, Kim. Okay, get on your knees. Okay, now, put this through the hole. You can get on your knees. This. Okay, just move that stuff out of your way, I know. Just use your hand and push it. You can put your hand in the water, too. Babe, the water is clean. It's clean water. Okay, you're gonna put it in the hole? I'll put it in the hole. Go ahead, mm-hmm. Come on, come on, get it in. Push it all the way through. Wiggle it, wiggle it, make it straight. Uh, okay, let me get in here. Okay. Okay, now here. Now this thing. Okay, this way. Go around to the back and turn it on, okay? So from the back. Can you see? Can you reach? I will hold this. Like this? The bottom one. The bottom one. Not stick your head out. You have to stick your head out through. Oh, oh, oh be careful. Can you, can you can your head get through? No. Your head can't get through, turn it sideways. Yeah, now you can see. Yes, can you reach? I'll hold it. Oh my it's God. It's so dark, I can't. Huh? It's really dark. Wait, Kim. Is that better? Yeah. Okay, wait, wait, Kim, I have to hold this. Wait, wait. Okay, go ahead, start turning it. I already did it. All right, keep turning it all the way. Guys, this is crazy, right? I can barely fit, but the good thing here is at least Kim arm was long enough to reach to get the nut on. It's tight. It's tight? Okay. Yeah. Her, oh. Daddy, there's another tool down here. I know. 
I think you can turn a little bit more. It's still loose. You can. <laughs> I can't do it. You can't do it? No. All right, all right. Okay, all right. Can you come back? Come back in. Yeah, watch your head. Okay. Now, I'm just going to need you to stay right here and hold it like this for me with your hand, okay? And I will go around to the back and tighten it, okay? Yeah. Ouch. Ouch. Okay, I'm going to go around. Excuse me. Oh. This one. Oh! Big body! Oh no, Kim, you did it backwards! That's why he's not going! Can you... Oh my goodness! I gotta come back around. <laughs> oh! <laughs> wait, wait. Can you please do it again? Do you remember, Kim, when we practiced? I told you which way for it to go? Oh. Alright, can you turn it and take it off? Go Come back on, off. go back around there. You gotta take it off. Yeah. Mhm. Mm yeah. Turn it the other way. This way. The different, the opposite way. Oh my goodness. <laughs> We're in trouble now. You got. You... Come on, turn it. Can you turn it? No. Hold it. Let then. me try yeah. go in. Huh? Let me try go in. She turned it. She turned it the wrong way. It's against the thread now. Oh come on, Kim. Well, I'm not doing it. All right. So we had to stop there for a second and get that bulkhead off. Kim had uh, put it in the wrong way and it was too tight and she couldn't get off. So Oi and I had to remove the bulkhead. After we got it off, then we went back to trying to get it on correctly. So let's go back to it. Go ahead. All right, Kim. Go ahead. Tighten it again. Hey guys, just to show you what is really going on here, and it's a tight fit back here. We got Kim saving the day, threading. I hope this again. It's already tight. Just, just, just do it again. Okay, so we got Kim here. Oh, the other Kim, way. The other way, babe. The other way, Kim. Get, get it nice and tight. That's perfect. You, you're doing great. Good. All right, you did such a good job. I'm so proud of you. Why don't you come on out now? Kim, say hi to everybody. Hi. You did such a great job. I'll take you out to dinner anywhere you want, all right? Yay. Yay. All right, why don't you come on out and be careful. All right, and then me and Mommy will finish this up. I'm going to take the wrench and tighten it off. I know, I know. All right, be careful. All right, you did such a good job, Kim. I am so proud of you. So you think about where you want to go for dinner while me and Mommy finish this up, okay? Yeah. Yay, thumbs up. Yeah. Give me a high five. All right, all right, you can go back to your iPad now. You're done. All right, guys. So now, me and Oi are gonna finish this up. I'm gonna tighten up with a wrench. Um, I don't think I'll be able to show you that part. And uh, once we get this going, I'm going to fill it back up, all right? Yeah, boy. I it's, need... It's still what? You need me to hold that. Okay. And how do you want me to film it? All right, just, just stop it for now. All right, guys, that was crazy. I'm so tired. My body's sore from, like, just, like, hanging on over there. But we're going to fill this thing back up. And hopefully, it's not going to leak anymore. It shouldn't leak. Like I said, we took care of the problem with that little notch of plastic on the bulkhead. And um, all goes well. I'll be putting fish in there in about five minutes, all right? Thank you guys for watching. Um, I know it wasn't a very exciting video. It was just basically me removing and fixing the bulkhead and putting it back on. But I just thought it was interesting that me and my wife, none of us could fit in there. And I had to recruit my daughter. So thank you, Kim. Thank you very much. You saved me today, all right? Thank you guys for watching. Peace. So we're at dinner now. Kim, so this is the place you chose, huh? Korean barbecue. You really know how to pick it. All right. Enjoy your meal. Enjoy your meal, okay?